Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And today we're gonna be learning some more some bomb spots in Zeppelin Wars. Um, these are gonna be my personal favorite bomb spots for the time bomb, specifically for the time bomb. <clears throat> we're gonna be going into to the time bomb in a little sec. So one of the better places for a bomb spot would be like right here on the fuel tank. These are very simple. I don't know why it's not. These are very simple, you know. Place your bomb right there. I don't know why my bomb doesn't let me place it. Hold up. So a good bomb spot would just be casually just right here, sitting right on the fuel tank. You know, right there. And that is just not because it's very simple. It's because you can actually defend it from enemy crew with the AA guns. But the only problem is, is this kind of like... Where a lot, a lot of people go when they spawn in, so they spawn in like, they spawn in, they spawn in right here, so that's kind of issue with this, but as you can see, it will blow off the netting off the tank, as you can see, and at least it's smoking, so yeah, it, it damages it a lot, but it's not enough to completely get rid of it that was bomb spot number one another good for number two if you put the time bomb right on the ammo box you can be right here yeah. well the crew members might think there's no one there but in reality when they walk through the door you can just <clears throat> eliminate them from the game and uh, yeah they're gonna have to respawn but by the time they respawn as crew um, the bomb might as well just been off, because it only has, you only have 30 seconds to defuse a bomb. As you can see, it may not completely destroy the bomb, okay it did, but it's very good, because now it completely destroyed that corridor, if you guys want me to show you it. So up here, as you can see, there's now just a massive hole here. Some people might actually fall down into the void, but it's really it's really good for destroying the ammo box and setting it on fire, especially this one. It sets it on fire. I don't know why, but it set this one on fire because it almost damaged broke them all or broke both of them. So we're going to be moving on to the third bomb placement for the bomb in a little bit. Another good spot is Below this ammo box, if I can get to it before this thing burns. So, so the ammo box is about about right there. It'll make it will probably not break the ammo box, but it will definitely um, leave it smoking or on fire, like this one. And it might even break some other ones. As you can see, I was very near the actual ammo box, just a little off. It will break the pathway. It might as well. It, the the thing will definitely fall <coughs> down here. Now, as you can see, that one that we set off earlier is really good because, as you can see, the entire lower deck is on fire. Yeah, it killed me on accident. But, yeah, as you can see, it does leave it very much on fire, which is good. You kind of want it on fire. <clears throat> so, just, yeah. Moving on to the next one in a sec. Another spot that's really good for the time bomb is right here because it leads right to the back fuel tank. So if we plant our bomb right there, it actually blows off some supports because you can completely detach the entire deck off the Zeppelin. Now, remember the ammo box that was here? Yeah, look at the aftermath of it. It's not good, but for you, it's amazing. Anyways, back to this bomb. It's supposed to be like around there. <clears throat> now let's just watch as it probably explodes. It explodes. I can't really tell if it actually got to the fuel tank. But we'll check it. Oh, not right now. As we can see, it didn't really, um, really put a hole in it. But we can put another bomb. I don't know where the fuel tank exactly is, but I'm just saying right there. And that will damage the fuel. Oh my. Yep, that. <laughs> I 
I just realized. I didn't mention about the first bomb we placed. Well, no, that wasn't. The second bomb we placed there was already on the on the um, ammo box. As you can see, it was very good. Completely removed this deck. Completely removed the back. And yeah, it's really good. The aftermath is good. How do I not fall off? So now we're just waiting for the bomb to go off. I may have actually... <clears throat> yep, and it did actually leave it smoking. Which you want that to happen. I'm lagging. So, um, yeah. That's a really ni good... That was a really nice bomb spot. Um, for the, uh, fuel... For above the fuel tank. Because the crewman can actually still... Rep but the crewman can still actually repair it, though. But... They can't... They might not be able to... Realize where the bombs are in time before the bombs go off right on the fuel tank. Which, you kind of want that. You don't want the crew to really fix anything. You just want them to, your bomb to, you know, explode. So, we're going to be moving on to the next bomb spot in a sec. For this next one, I decided to do a little thing, a little special thing. I am now on skirmish, which is two light zeppelins if you didn't know that. So there's two light zeppelins here, <clears throat> and uh, a good spot for this tor for this bomb is actually on the on the torpedoes because these torpedoes are actually really good at devastating the front of zeppelins. Of course, you can put it on the normal cannons, but the torpedoes they as the, uh, they only have four torpedoes, but still they're really devastating when you spam the torpedoes. Spam all four torpedoes at your zeppelin. You kind of don't want that, so you plant your bomb on the torpedo in order to move the torpedo, or at least make it not very fun to get to. So, two, one. You can see the torpedo managed to survive, but it's kind of now accessible from basically other torpedoes. So. This is an original torpedo look. As you saw, it literally blew off all this armor. And that was not what you want. So, we're going to be moving on to the next one in a sec. <clears throat> now, most likely, that torpedo wasn't destroyed. So, yeah. But, so, and if you want to destroy it, though, you just take your bomb and you plant it, right? Well, that's just an idea for you guys. But the actual next Somewhere where you might as well just stay forced, yeah. But, you might think I might be talking about the fuel tank, but actually, all you have to do, plant your bomb right, right on the door. Plant it right here. Or anywhere on this gray spot. Then you flip this lever, and then it's hard to defuse it, but also might not do much damage, but it's hard to defuse. And, um, yeah, you have to get to the lever, and you have to be on the other side to, um, you know, close it, but, uh, to defuse it. But, uh, that bomb goes off, and, um, you know, it destroys this pathway. Might destroy other things. Oh, I fell. Whoops. But, um, that's kind of the idea. Show you guys the damage once I get there again. So, yeah. This is the damage happening that happened with that one bomb. As you can see, it wasn't really much. It took a bit of the pathway, but this pathway is actually kind of important for getting across. Of course, you can just go over here, but, like, you know, kind of important pathway. A lot of people actually use that pathway a lot. Probably because it's really in the middle of Zeppelin, and it's kind of used for accessing other spots. And we're going to be moving on to the next bomb spot in a second. Now, the next bomb spot is kind of an interesting position. Not really, you're just kind of right there. Like, this is a really good bomb spot. Like, just in this back area, right over here. It'll blow up, it'll blow up a lot of stuff. And, you know, it's important stuff, really. The ammo box is important for, you know, the torpedoes. I don't know why the cover's on the front, but okay, let it be. So, this will blow up this kind of area. <clears throat> We're just waiting for it to explode, so, yeah. You see some better bomb spots on Skirmish. As you can see, it devastated a lot of things, you know. 
Uh, that ammo box was very important. Now you can't flip the um, thing because this thing will eventually despawn and you might be able to, but it's kind of hard. Yeah, you can, but yeah, it's not very practical, but yeah. So that was the devastation from one and uh, this fire. It put a fire here that you don't want to fire on your weapon, so yeah. We're going to be moving on to the next one in a sec. So we're here at the next bomb spot, which is just right here. You plant your bomb behind the fuel tank. It, I'm pretty sure the protective stuff will go away. It's kind of hard to get out, but it's also kind of hard to get in, in or defuse it. Of course, you can probably defuse it to the wall, but you can't really tell where the bomb is until you go over here. <clears throat> and if you do kill the crew who try to defuse it to the wall, it will um, not be good for them because by then the bomb is about to go off. So it's yeah, it will leave the fuel tank smoking. It does blow off the protection. It does blow this wall. It does overall great damage to basically the zeppelin itself. As you can see, the pathways, the wooden pathways, have been completely blown off. These things are good. So that was the final bomb spot. So. I'll see you guys in the next video next time I'm going to post it. Bye.